Right, ladies and gentlemen, Jaguar E-Type. I'm quite excited about this one. Uh, we all love a good E-Type, don't we? Uh, and I dare say I'm going to stick my chin out and say it's probably the best E-Type. Almost, I'd probably say we've ever had, but certainly had for a long, long, long time. Um, it is absolutely stunning. Um, Paul's been dealing with the car, um, so I will get him up to um, tell you a bit more about it. But he's told me a few basic bits. Um, but to be fair, the car speaks for itself. I mean, it is lovely. Really, really nice. I've done a million photographs of it, so you can see all underneath how, you know, the subframes are it's like a nut and bolt restoration. Uh, it really is. It's been, the gentleman's unfortunately passed away, um, but it was over the course of four to five years uh, of restoring the car, and um, it just goes to show. It is really, really nice. Um, you know, triple carbs on there. I mean, under the engine bay. Oh, look at that! It's beautiful. It really is, really nice. Some good, tasteful modifications under there, um, and just everywhere you look, everywhere you look is really, really nice. Everywhere. Um, yeah, just uh, you're sort of lost for words. Really, it's one of them cars. You just got to come and see it to really appreciate. Um, how nice it is. I mean, interior wise is lovely. Um, I believe they are MX-5 seats in there. Um, but aren't they nice? Just really, really nice. Lovely interior. Everything's just, just stunning. It really is. I can't put into words um, how nice it is. What's it showing? 47327. Whether that's correct or not, I'm not sure. Make your own inquiries. Um, but yeah, really nice. Uh, a mobiliser just on that lead there fitted. Uh, it's got a tracker as well, a few nice little goodies in the um, armrest there. Um, it's just, yeah, I'm sort of lost for words really. Five speed conversion, um, which is a five speed look on there. Paul went down the road in it when he, uh, when he brought it in and said it is the best driving E-Type he has ever driven. Uh, so that coming from Paul is a big statement. Uh, and does mean a lot um, so any info please give Paul a ring um, he'll tell you everything he knows about it um, but yeah he said it's the best one he's ever driven so that's a fair statement on its own isn't it um, in the back we've got lovely Jaguar cover um, he said we've got some bits for the hood there brand new I can't remember what he said now what we got Um, a few goodies of oh, brand new hood cover there um, it looks like oh it's all one that yeah brand new hood cover in there um, obviously a car cover it's on its own um, a bit of all sorts a few bits of extra trim etc bits and pieces like that um, and there's a uh, hard top stand somewhere to go with it as well he said um, don't know where that is, we'll find it, I'll get it photographed. Uh, and yeah, a, a hard top stand. Um, but yeah, what more can you say? Everywhere you look is lovely. Um, please do come down and see it for yourself. Certainly worth travelling for. Um, very much so indeed. What have we got paperwork wise? Uh, one former keeper showing on the V5. The choir, yeah, yeah, yeah. A couple of booklets and bits and pieces to go with it. We've got in this bit. Spare key there, certificate number. Um, yeah, lovely history folder here with old bill of sale there. Look, where's that? Yeah, isn't that nice? Original Villa sale. Um, invoices, a few nice bits and pieces in here. MOT certificates, some more invoices there. So a good, look, 7,200. Another grand there, 3,000 there. There was another thousand. <laughs> Three, another three it soon adds up, doesn't it? So um, a lovely bit of 
history and bills and invoices um, to go with the car. Great big booklet there, look. Come down and have a look. Check it all out for yourself. Um, but yeah, certainly won't be disappointed. Certainly won't be disappointed. So all in all, lovely, lovely car. Paintwork, they've done a fantastic job. They really have. Certainly under the bonnet. You don't know where to look, it's that shiny. Uh, so yeah, really, really nice good plate on there as well um, just a nice nice car not trying to be anything it's not um, it's just yeah like I've said many times it's lovely so please come down guys check it out for yourself um, in the meantime I might get Paul down and do a better video um, as he knows the ins and outs a little bit more than me um, but to be fair yeah look at it it's lovely isn't it it's down on display at Pickering, so um, please do.